I'm Leslie Smith. I train out of the Caesar Gracie Jiu Jitsu Academy, and I'm fighting Sarah Kaufman on April 5th at Invicta 5. And this is such a great opportunity. She's a former Strike Force champion. She's one of the people that really built up the sport and took a lot of fights, and someone that I watched, you know, coming up. So I'm super excited to get this chance to get to fight her. It's a huge opportunity for me. I just brushed into the rankings, the top 10 rankings. So for me to get to be um, fighting, fighting the woman who's ranked number two right now, it's a, it's a great opportunity. I'm really excited. Really glad to hear that you're seeing that I look pretty technical today. Um, I, uh, I try to do it in the practicing to have the muscle memory because once I'm in there and I'm going, there's not a whole lot of thought about the technique for me. I'm, I'm just going for it. Really, at the end of the day, at nighttime, when I'm going to bed, when I'm like, well, what do I have on this woman and how do I know I'm going to beat her? It's that I, I just know I'm a little crazier than anybody else. So technique, hopefully I can practice that and have it for me. but. If nothing else, I can get crazier than she can. We're both stand-up fighters. We both really like the striking. We both really like to go in there and bang. As a matter of fact, both of us were up for fight of the year last year for, uh, for our fights. Mine against Caitlin Young and hers against Alexis Davis. And it's because they were both battles, just stand-up battles and wars. And I, everybody wins in those. Um, I mean, of course, I want to be like the ultimate winner in that, but everybody wins in those because it's a good fight. It's exciting to watch. I think that my my wrestling and my ground is going to be better than hers. Invicta's huge. This is really the best time to be a female fighter right now. I feel so lucky that I got into it um, about five years, a little over five years ago, when it was, you know, just small enough that pretty much anybody could get in. And, uh, and now it's huge, and now it's big. There's women in the UFC, and, and that is because of Invicta. I mean, Ronda Rousey, not taking anything away from her, she's great, she's awesome, she's got a great record, great you know, skill set, and uh, the star power, she's gotten a whole lot of attention for it. I think it's the combination of you know, her star power getting into the UFC, and, and Invicta proving that, that women can captivate audiences solely based on their fighting skills, and that's huge. Invicta's making it possible that, that you can train, you can get recognition, you can get sponsors, you can have uh, this promotion that, that stands behind you, that is proud of you, will promote you, that, uh, you know, they're, they're not protecting their fighters, they're giving everybody legit fights, they're setting up the best fights for the fans, which is the, the important thing to get that legitimacy. So yesterday I got to do some sparring with Chris Cyborg. Man, she's awesome. Um, we did five rounds. It was really, really cool. It was an honor to get to be in the ring with her, to get to be training with her. Uh, she's a beast. She's a total beast. I learned a lot from her just yesterday, just seeing the intensity that she brings in. and. Um, and uh, Hopefully I can carry that with me for the rest of the time. I gotta say Cyborg's gonna win. I gotta say, if, if it ever works out that they get to do the fight, I don't think Ronda has a chance. There's just no chance. I mean, she walks in, she's done the same thing in all of her fights, right? She comes in jabbing, 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 pushes someone against the cage or ties up with them away from the cage and then does her thing. But she's not, you can't do that with Cyborg. So there's not. As far as imposing wills, um, it's going to be Cyborg's will that gets imposed. I want to say thank you to the guys down here at Rain Training Center for letting me train today. Uh, I really super appreciate it. Um, you know, my sponsors, Loyalty Before Royalty, Rev Gear, you guys are always awesome. Cesar Gracie and my MMA coach, Alessandro Fejera. Uh, thank you all. Appreciate it. And uh, thank you, Spencer, for talking to me. Thanks for listening, guys. Make sure that you check out my fight. April 5th, Invicta 5, you can stream it online. It's like eight bucks. You can get it anywhere in the world. Check it out and uh, cheer me on against Sarah Kaufman.